the land that has given India its thaliba and innumerable gems over years. Will it give India its first pitch in your quiz champion? It is the state of Subramanya Bharati, Tirupur Kumaran, Velu Nachir and Subramanya Siva. It is the state of F1 star, Karun Chando, one of India's most successful squash players, Deepika Palikal, and Grandmaster Vishwanathan Anand is regarded as one of the greatest chess players. It is the land that cherishes its movies, stars and knowledge. Saying so, we welcome you to the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and Ministry of Education with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav is an initiative of the Government of India to celebrate and commemorate 75 years of progress of India and the glorious history of its people, culture and achievements. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness like none other. The Fit India Quiz provides an opportunity to students and schools to win cash prizes of rupees 3.25 crore and be the champion at state and national level. In the preliminary round, 36,299 students from 13,502 schools participated in the mobile based test conducted by the National Testing Agency. Participation was from more than 626 districts across India. After the preliminary rounds, 360 schools will be participating in the state web rounds where they will be competing with the selected schools from their respective state or union territory to become state or union territory champion and represent their state or union territory in the national finals. Without any further delay, let's go to our virtual auditorium to meet our quiz master for today. Welcome everyone to the Fit India Quiz quarterfinal Tamil Nadu edition. Let's go and meet our quarterfinalists for today. And participants, please remember that the top two scorers of this round will represent their school and state at the state semi-finals. Students, let's have a quick round of introduction. Team one, can you please introduce yourself? Um, we are from Kendra Vidyalaya number two, Palpaka. Myself, Lakshmi and myself, Parika. Alright girls, who is your favourite sports person? Um, for me, it's Serena Williams. Okay. For me, it's uh, Sunil Chetri. Okay, welcome Team 1. Thank you. Thank you. Team 2, can you please introduce yourself? We are from Oxford Matriculation Higher Secondary School, Sivaganga. I myself, LP Victor Nasi. I am Sujana. And who is your favorite sports person? Um, for mine, PV Sindhu. For mine, Mahindra Singh Dhoni. All right, girls. Welcome, Team Two. Team Three, can you please introduce yourself? We are from Pushpalaka Metric Higher Secondary School. I am Vishwesh. And I am Naziha Patima. All right, Team. Who is your favorite sports person? For me, it's Sachin Tendulkar. And for me, it's Anya Mirza. All right, team, a very warm welcome to Team 3 as well. Moving on, Team 4, can you please introduce yourself? We are from Vidya Mandir Estancia. I am Mukul and this is Harsha Vajan. All right, boys, who is your favorite sports person? For me, it's Virat Kohli. For me, it's Kidambi Srikant. Okay, a very warm welcome to you too, Team 4. It's now time to introduce our expert of the day. And our expert of the day is Mr. Kaushik Roy. Captain Fit, a very warm welcome to you, sir. Yeah, thank you very much. And a warm welcome to the students today. I'm your Captain Fit. In any case, uh, I mean, if you feel any problem, if any questions, you can ask me. I'll be there to help you out. And all the best to all the students here. Thank you so much, Captain Fit. You're welcome. All right, fitness kiddos, Aadha Ghanta Rose. Before we move on to the first round, I would like to tell all our participants that besides Captain Fit, you have two more helplines. One being heads or tails that will make two incorrect options disappear and toss the question which you can use to completely change your question. Moving on to the first round, are you guys ready? Yes, just show me your hands. Come on. All the best teams. Here is round number one. 
फिटनेस की डोज एंड हियर आर द रूल्स ऑन योर स्क्रीन फिटनेस की डोज क्वेश्चन ऑन योगा फिटनेस एंड न्यूट्रिशन क्लॉक वाइज राउंड डिरेक्ट क्वेश्चन टू ईच टीम द क्वेश्चन विल नॉट पास करेक्ट आंसर विल फेच टेन पॉइंट एंड इफ लाइफ लाइन इज यूज करेक्ट आंसर विल फेच फाइव पॉइंट नो नेगेटिव मार्किंग लाइफ लाइन आर अवेलेबल Quiz master's decision is final. So you saw the rules. The rules are very simple. The first question is going to be for team one. The second question for team two. The third question for team three, and the fourth question for team four. There will be three lifelines. If you think you are in dicey situation and you quite don't know the correct answer, you can use your lifelines this time. Moving on to the first question from fitness kiddos for team one on your screen. Which type of yoga exercise literally stands for control of energy or breath? A kriya B bhujangasana C hanumanasana and D pranayama And your time starts now. Option D Option D Pranayama Do you want to say pranayama? Yes. All right, we'll take that answer team 1. because yes it is absolutely the correct answer congratulations to you one you just earned yourself 10 points <laughs> moving on to the second question for team 2 on your screen in human body there are three types of muscle tissues apart from smooth and skeletal which is the third one a cardiac b abdominal c dynamic and d aerobic and your time starts now a cardiac muscle a cardiac muscle all right we will take that answer because yes it is absolutely the correct answer team to you just on your self 10 points yes girls you can smile <laughs> moving on to the third question of this round for team 3 On which date International Yoga Day is celebrated annually since 2015? A 21st May B 21st June C 21st July and D 5th June and your time starts now. Option B 21 June 21st June all right we'll take that answer Team three, because yes, it is the absolutely the correct answer. Congratulations, Steve! You just earned yourself ten points. <laughs> Moving on to the final question from Fitness Kiddos for Team Four on your screen. Which present-day gym equipment owes its origin to halters, once used in ancient Greece to lift weights? A dumbbell. B kettleball C medicine ball and D pulley and your time starts now We can use a lifeline and pass You want to use a lifeline which lifeline do, would you like to use Head or tail Head or tail all right we will use head or tail team 4 and here are dumb. the final two options on your screen a dumbbell and c medicine ball come on a, look at it you can gauge it easily it looks quite simple a, and dumbbell. you have to answer now your time is up it's a dumbbell a dumbbell all right team we will take that answer because yes it is dumbbell Congratulations you just earned yourself 5 points. Well that was our round 1. We will take a short break and right after the break we will take a look at this cause. Fit India quiz mein desh ke kone kone se bhag lene wale sabhi vidyarthiyon ka main abhinandan karta hu aur aasha karta hu ki aap sabhi ji jaan lagayenge jeetne ke liye khelenge. फिट इंडिया क्विज में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं 
जय हिंद जय भारत to the break to the quarter final of the fit india quiz tamil nadu edition presented by ministry of youth affairs and sports ministry of education with fit india mission in celebration of azadi ka amrit mahotsav fit india quiz is the biggest indian quiz on sports and fitness now let's take a look at the scores team 4 at 5 points team 1 2 and 3 at 10 points amazing Now it's time for our next round and our next round is champion of champions. Let's take a look at the rules. Champions of champions. Questions on Indian sports personalities. Each clue on the buzzer. There will be three clues to guess the answer. Each clue will fetch 15, 10 and 5 points respectively. The question will not pass. Wrong answer will fetch minus 5 points. No additional lifelines for this round. Quiz master's decision is final. Well, students, this is going to be a buzzer round. This is going to be really fun. The first clue will be for 15 points, the second clue for 10 points, and the third clue are going to be for 5 points. So if you are going to buzz, you have to give me the answer whether it is right or wrong. If you give me the correct answer, you get the points. If you give me a wrong answer, there will be minus 5 points. But don't think about that. Think about the 15 points that you are going to earn. in the very first clue and the first question for 15 points the first clue is here on your screen from champion of champions nickname payoli express she was born on 27th june 1964 in kerala her sporting talent was first noticed in 1977 by om nambiar and team 1 team 1 you buzz Uh, P T Usha. P T Usha will take the answer, Team One, because it is the correct answer. Well done, girls! You just earned your team fifteen points. <laughs> Moving on to our second question from Champion of Champions, and the first clue for fifteen points is here on your screen. She played women's test cricket for India in 16 matches from 76 to 1991. Captaining the side in 8 matches in 1976 to 77 and 4 in 1983 to 84. India recorded its first ever test win in November 1976 against West Indies under this all-rounder's captaincy. Anyone Okay moving on to the second okay team 3 team 3 yes team 3 Shanta Rangaswamy Come again Shanta Rangaswamy Shanta Ramaswamy all right we will take that answer because yes it is the correct answer congratulations you just earned yourself 15 points It is Shanta Rangaswamy Here is question number 3 and the first clue for 15 points is here on your screen. Born on 20th June 1956, he was a very important member of the gold winning Indian hockey team at the 1980 Moscow Olympics. He was nicknamed the gentleman of hockey. Come on teams. All right moving on to clue number 2 for 10 points. He later became the captain of the team for this con Going one more time with the clue number 2 for 10 points. He later became the captain of the team for his contribution to the game. He was honored with the Padma Shri in 2012. Yes team 1 I know you're thinking you think a little harder you can get it. All right, I don't think anybody is buzzing right now. Moving on to the third clue for 5 points. 
Yes, yeah, Steve, you can, you can. I can see it in your face. All right, we don't have a single bar, so we will take a look at the answer. It is Zafar Iqbal. Okay, nobody had a clue. No problem. Moving on to the fourth question. And the first clue for 15 points is here on your screen. Born on 17th June 1973 in Kolkata, he became the first Indian and only tennis player to compete in seven Olympic Games. Team 3. Leander Pace. Leander Pace. All right, we'll take that answer, Team 3, because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 15 more points. That was the end of this round. We will take a short break and right after the break, we are going to take a look at this cause. Fit rehna utna muskil kaam nahi hai jitna kuch logon ko lagta hai. Fitness ki dose aadha ghanta roj. Is mantra mein sabhi ka swast, sabhi ka sukh छिपा हुआ है We are back after the break to the quarter final of the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. And our Honorable Prime Minister could not have said in a better way how important fitness is in our lives. Fitness ki doz, aadha ghanta roz. It's time to take a look at the scores. T4 at 5 points, Team 2 at 10 points, Team 1 at 25 points and Team 3 leading right now with 40 points. <laughs> Amazing guys, let me just tell you, these are just one single question. You're in a difference of one question. If you answer one question, you're going to come very close to each other, right? So play well. Our next round is Bharat Ke Khel. And here are the rules on your screen. Bharat Ke Khel. Questions on traditional Indian sports. Anti-clockwise round. Direct questions to each team. No passing. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. As you have seen, this is Bharat Ke Khel. This is going to be anti-clockwise round. The first question is going to be for team 4. The second question for team 3. The third question for team 2. And the fourth question is going to be for team 1. Okay? This is the last round where you can actually use your lifelines. So if you think you are in a situation where you don't know the correct answer, use lifeline here. And this is the first question for team 4. From Bharat Ke Khel, on your screen. A traditional part of Pongal celebration in South India, which indigenous sport pits crowds of brave young men against angry bulls? A. Balamkali, B. Jalikattu, C. Kalare Patyu, and D. Ubi Lakri. And your time starts now. Option B, Jali Kattu. Option B, Jali Kattu. All right. We will take that answer, team. And yes, it is the correct answer. Congratulations. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to the second question for team three. Tamil Nadu State game is dash. Fill in the blanks. A, archery. B, football. C. Kabaddi 
or D hockey? And your time starts now. Option C Kabaddi. Option C Kabaddi will take that answer team 3 because it is the correct answer. Congratulations you just earned yourself 10 more points. <laughs> Moving on to the third question for team 2 on your screen. Among the following rules and regulations of which sport is formulated by Deccan Gymkhana of Pune? A. Ball badminton B. Kabaddi C. Kho Kho or D. Mallakam And your time starts now. Lifeline Lifeline? Which lifeline would you like to use? Tell me. Captain Fit Captain Fit, yes, of course. Captain Fit, you are requested here, sir. Uh, I suggest you can go for option uh, C, Coco. All right, what is your final answer, team two? Option C, Coco. Option C, Coco will take the answer, team two. And yes, it is absolutely correct. Congratulations, team two. You just earned yourself five more points. And thank you so much, Captain Phil. You're welcome. Moving on to the final question from Bharat Kekel. And the last question is for Team 1 on your screen. It is known as Tip Cat in English, Dandi Bio in Nepali, Alak Dolak in Persian, and Konko in Cambodian. How do we know it in India? A. Kushti B. Gilly Danda C. Kauri Khel and D. Malakam And your time starts now. Uh, we would like to use a lifeline. You would like to use a lifeline. Which lifeline would you like to use? Captain Fit. Captain Fit, of course. Captain Fit, you are requested here, sir. Yeah, uh, I suggest you go for option B, Gilly Danda. All right, team one, what is your final answer? Option B, Gilly Danda. Option B, Gilly Danda. We'll take that answer, team one, because yes, it is absolutely correct. Gilly Danda is the one. Thank you so much, Captain Fritz. You're welcome. Well, you just earned yourself five points, team one. And by that, we are at the end of this round. It's time to take a break. And right after the break, we are going to take a look at the scores. Fit India quiz में देश के कोने कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूं और आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे, जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे, Fit India quiz में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे। आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं, जय हिंद, जय भारत। We are back after the break to the quarter-final of the Fit India Quiz Tamil Nadu edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports. Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness. Now it's time to take a look at the scores. Team 2 and Team 4 at 15 points each. Team 1 at 30 points and Team 3 leading right now with 50 points. Well done, teams. Moving on to the final round of this quiz. Our next round is freestyle. Let's take a look at the rules. Freestyle. Sports mixed bad questions. 12 questions on the buzzer. Correct answer will fetch each team 10 points. Minus 5 for wrong answer after buzzer. No additional lifelines for this round. Quiz master's decision is final. All right, teams, as you have seen, this is going to be a buzzer round. There'll be 12 questions. You, If you press the buzzer, you have to answer whether you give us the correct answer or wrong. If you give us the correct answer, you get 10 points. If you don't, 
minus 5 points. And do remember, this is the round that is going to determine whether you are representing your school and state at the state semi-finals or not. So, get ready, finger on your buzzer because here is the first question from Freestyle on your screen. The word archery comes from the Latin word arcus, meaning bow, true or false. Yes, team four. True. Team four, true. a little louder. It's true. It is true. All right, we'll take that answer, team four, because it is true. Congratulations, you just earned yourself 10 more points. Moving on to the second question on your screen. Identify this young Subedar from the Indian Army who created history in 2021. Team 3. Neeraj Chopra. All right, we'll take that answer, Team 3, because it is Neeraj Chopra. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 10 more points. Moving on to the third question on your screen. Which noted practitioner of Kaleri Paitu has been selected as one of the fit India icons, Amish Tripathi or Vidyut Jamwal? Yes, team four. Vidyut Jamwal. Vidyut Jamwal. All right, we'll take that answer, team four, because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, team four. You just earned yourself 10 more points. Well done, teams. You're playing really well. Moving on to our next question. Question number four is, Autobiography of which legendary hockey player is very appropriately titled Goal? Team three. Major Dhyan Chand. Major Dhyan Chand. All right. We will take that answer because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, team three. You just earned yourself 10 more points. Moving on to our fifth question on your screen. Which team won the inaugural edition of ICC Men's T20 World Cup in 2007? Team 3. India. India. All right, Team 3, we will take that answer. Because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 10 more points. <laughs> question number 6 from Freestyle. Here we go. How many types of jump events are there in athletics in Olympics? It's a very easy answer. Trust me, guys. Yes, team two. Four. Four? We will take that answer, team two. Because it is absolutely the correct answer. Congratulations, team two. You just earned yourself 10 more points. And here is our next question on the screen. Given to the coaches and trainers for their overall contribution to the world of sports, which prestigious award is this? Team 3. Dronacharya Award. Dronacharya Award? Are you saying that? Yes, ma'am. All right, we will take that answer, Team 3, it, because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 3. You just earned yourself 10 more points. <laughs> Moving on to question number 8 on your screen. Which sport is played on an arena named Diamond? Team 4. Baseball. Baseball. All right, Team 4, we will take that answer because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 4. You just earned yourself 10 more points. <laughs> Moving on to question number 9 on your screen. In which sport the equipment called mallet is used? Team 1. Pole. Oh. All right, team one, we will take that answer. But no, it is not the correct answer. It is not four, it is four low. Never mind, team one, minus five points for you. Moving on to the 10th question on your screen. 
In which year did India win the gold medal in hockey for the first time in Olympics? 1924 or 1928 and team 4? 1928. 1928. All right, team 4. We will take that answer because yes, it is the correct answer. Congratulations, team 4. You just earned yourself 10 points. <laughs> Moving on to our second last question of this round. Let's take a look. Tour de France is a famous cycling championship. True or false? Team 4. False. Alright, Team 4. We will take that answer. But no, it is true. You, it is on, on the page. Can you see it? Tour de France. Never mind, Team 4. Minus 5 points. Moving on to the final question from Freestyle. Which movie was made on the life of the man standing with Amir Khan? Team 1. Dangal. Dangal, we will take that answer, Team 1. Because it is the correct answer. Congratulations, Team 1. You just earned yourself 10 points. Now it's time to take a short break. And right after the break, we are going to take a look at the final scoreboard. लाइफ में चैलेंजेस कभी भी और कहीं भी आ सकते हैं और हम इनका अच्छे से तभी सामना कर सकते हैं जब हम तैयार हों इनको फेस करने के लिए हम अगर हेल्दी और फिट हैं तो हमारी तैयारी और भी बेहतर हो जाती है बस जरूरत है थोड़ी सी मेहनत थोड़े से अनुशासन की प्रेजेंटिंग फिट इंडिया मोबाइल ऐप आपका फिटनेस गाइड और पर्सनल हेल्थ ट्रेनर पहली बार अब भारत का हर एक नागरिक अपना फिटनेस कोर पता करके जान पाएगा कि वो कितना फिट है आप अपनी आयु के अनुसार अपने फिटनेस कोर की जांच कर सकते हैं ये सुविधा खास आपके लिए पहली बार शुरू की जा रही है ये ऐप आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को ट्रैक कर सारा डेटा स्टोर करता है ताकि आप अपनी प्रोग्रेस देख सकें और फिट रहने के नए और आसान नुस्खे अपना पाए इस ऐप के साथ आप बन सकते हैं खुद के फिटनेस मास्टर उसके बाद हम आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को बनाने में आपकी मदद करेंगे फिटनेस की दुनिया में कदम रखें मोटिवेटेड रहें और अपडेटेड रहें और सबसे अच्छी बात है कि इन सारी सुविधाओं का लाभ आप पा सकते हैं एकदम फ्री बस अपने एंड्रॉइड और एप्पल डिवाइस पर हमारे ऐप का हिंदी और इंग्लिश वर्जन डाउनलोड करें और शुरू हो जाइए आपका फिट रहने का सपना अब है एक क्लिक दूर फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज वी आर बैक आफ्टर द ब्रेक टू द क्वार्टर फाइनल ऑफ द फिट इंडिया क्विज तमिलनाडु एडिशन प्रेजेंटेड बाय मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ यूथ अफेयर्स एंड स्पोर्ट्स मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एजुकेशन विद फिट इंडिया मिशन इन सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ आजादी का अमृत महोत्सव before we move on to see the scores let me just remind you that you too can download the fit india app from the play store or app store and be fit every minute every day and now we move on to that part of the episode which the audience is eagerly waiting for the fit india daily quiz question the process to participate in this quiz is very simple i will ask one question related to sports and fitness here all you have to do is to log into the Fit India mobile app and answer the question in the Fit India daily quiz section. The user who gives the correct answer in the fastest time will win a Fit India merchandise. Also, some of the lucky winners will stand a chance to be in the grand finale of the Fit India quiz. Just download or update the Fit India mobile app, which is India's most comprehensive fitness app offering features like generating your fitness score, customized diet plans, steps tracker, calorie tracker, sleep tracker and much more. And the biggest advantage is that you can use all of these features for absolutely free. This is only being offered by the Fit India mobile app. Right, so here is the question for this episode. A short at history by my obsessive journey to Olympic gold is the autobiography of which sports person? We will go with the question one more time. Going live. A shot at history, my obsessive journey to Olympic gold, is the autobiography of which sports person? A. MC Maricom, 
B. Neera Chopra C. Abhinav Bindra and D. Rajivardhan Singh Rathor And now it's time to take a look at the final scoreboard Team 2 at 25 points Team 1 at 35 points Team 4 with 50 points and the winner is Team 3 with 90 points. Congratulations to Team 4 and Team 3 for qualifying for the state semi-finals. With this, we are at the close of the quarter-final of the Fit India Quest Tamil Nadu edition. A big thank you to the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and the Ministry of Education for giving all of us, and especially the children of India, the opportunity to be on a platform like this. This is me, Dia Das, signing off. And don't forget the magical mantra, Fitness Ki Dose, Aadha Ghanta Dose.